Are you ready for today's funky item? Like they're the ugliest thing. Yeah, <laughs> I've got a stretch. You're a big old nut, but I don't like nuts. <laughs> Hello my beautiful friends and welcome back to my channel! So friends, today we have a big ass pretty little thing haul. We've got one bag, the big bag, it's full of a lot of things. We've got two bags <laughs> and we've got some shoes over there. So I mean, it's a good day. It's a good goddamn day. So in today's video, I've got going out clothes, I've got summer clothes, I've got comfy clothes. We've got a little bit of everything. So I think it's going to be a... Uh, a fun time. So yeah, today's video is very kindly sponsored by Pretty Little Thing and I'm so excited about that. I have done so many Pretty Little Thing hauls on my channel since I started my YouTube channel. I think you guys know, if you know, you know where it's at. Um, but yes, I will leave all the links for the clothes that I'm going to show you guys down in the description box below. And I also just want to say in today's video, we're going to change it up a little bit because I have so many items. Instead of sitting here and going, I've got this and then trying it on, I'm just going to get my ass up off the chair and just show you guys the items on me instead of sitting here because I just feel like it's a little bit pointless the more I think of it. You know, why don't I just get up to begin with? So yeah, that's what we're going to be doing today. So with all that said, let's just dive right on in to the video. <laughs> okay, so this is the first item I picked up and it's this gorgeous summer dress. And I adore this to the point where it's actually now one of my favorite summer dresses, even though I've not worn it yet. But it's just such a cute little design, I feel. So it's like an orangey, rusty, burnt kind of color um, with polka dots on. And I don't actually own that many things with polka dots on because I've never been a huge fan. But I saw this dress. I actually saw someone wearing this on Instagram and I was like, oh my goodness, you look amazing. I need. Mean. It's quite a low cut here, as you can see. So you couldn't really wear a bra with it because you'd be able to see the bra. And now I don't have a lot of cleavage. So I didn't think that this was going to suit me because, you know, normally if you don't have cleavage, wearing things like this can be a little bit risque because sometimes if you bend over like you know everything can be on show but that's not actually happening with this dress and I kind of think it's because of the belt and you can kind of like tuck this in there I just couldn't see this dress not being flattering on any body type because it pulls you in here it's flowy like the sleeves are quite loose and baggy and um, it's got a lot of room for boobs or no boobs per se um, but yeah and I also think you can dress this up or dress it down like you could pair this with like some heels or a pair of tights in the winter even with some biker boots or else you could just go out with some like sandals on. Tell me this is not the coolest dress you've ever seen. I am so weak for this. This is like so a bit of me. I can't even explain it. I adore this. It's kind of like a denim -y kind of material, that kind of material. Um, obviously you button up these sleeves, but do you know them buttons that you can't actually do on your own, especially when like they're at your wrists, it's really difficult to do, um, so just ignore that. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I did see Jordan Lip Scrum wearing this, and um, she picked it up in one of her Pretty Little Thing hauls, and I was like, I need that. She looked unbelievable in it, like so good. I don't look half as good as her in it, but I mean, you know, God loves a tryer. So this will be one of the more kind of chill outfits I have in today's video. So the first thing we have is this little crop top. <clears throat> Jesus. <laughs> it just says pretty little thing across it um, and it's super cropped and this actually came in a pack of two. So you also get the exact same top in white and it just says pretty little thing across it as well. Um, so you're basically getting two tops for the price of one because these do come in a pack of two and I feel like these are so versatile. There's so many things they can go with, you know. I know myself there's so many times when I throw in a pair of trousers or a skirt or a pair of shorts and I'm just looking for a little black or white crop top and um, so I just find that these would be perfect for that kind of thing with trousers with skirts with shorts with tracksuit bottoms with absolutely anything throwing a little baggy crop over it is perfect and especially in the summertime because you know they're not stuck to your pits or anything so you're not going to be getting big sweat patches because there's like loads of room in there and um, so then we also have these joggers and these are just some white joggers I have been wanting to get my hands on a pair of white joggers for the longest time I've been really afraid to do it mainly because I can't be trusted with white like I just destroy everything in my path so yeah I'm kind of glad I did bite the bullet and go for them because I love them I feel like they just look so sick I don't know there's something about a white pair of joggers that I just love um, and then my favorite 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 thing is these shoes I'll just show you guys them back here um, and then I'll take them off but like these are honestly the coolest shoes I own, like, no word of a lie. I hope that's focusing. Is it focusing? He's focusing. Can you be dealing? They're basically like white biker moon boots. 
I don't know how you even describe them, but I have seen so many girls wearing these lately um, and they're just so stylish. They go with so much. I feel like these are such a versatile shoe and they're that material. They're that material that you can clean easily. Can we just get a hell yeah. They're also like the comfiest thing ever, like so comfortable. Honestly, I would urge you to pick these up because I went to try and buy them like three times and every time they were sold out, like they're obviously super popular. I think like these kinds of shoes, like these white kind of moon boots have really come into fashion like the last number of months and everybody's trying to get them. Beyonce who? Beyonce who? Beyonce who? <laughs> okay, so I picked up this jumpsuit and I think this is beautiful now i can't actually tie the zip up myself well i could tie it on myself but if i tie it on myself i won't be able to open it so we're just gonna leave it like this um but yeah it's so unique i love the detail of this i honestly feel like this is something beyonce would wear like i wasn't even joking um but yeah we've just got like a flared leg down the bottom it's kind of like a fitted leg into a flared leg i could have done with picking this up in a size six i actually got this in an eight because I was worried it would be like really small fitting, but it's quite stretchy. So, um, you know, don't feel like you need to size up for this item or anything. We've got a little bit of padding in the shoulder, which I think is cute. I'm not normally a fan of padding um, in shoulders, but I actually think it works in this um, piece because you've got like this shoulder exposed. And I love jumpsuits because I don't have to tan. I don't have to worry about shaving. You know, I just throw it on. I look cute but nobody knows what's hiding underneath. So it's absolutely great. <laughs> okay, so we've gone with another comfy casual item. So I just picked up this big oversized t-shirt dress. And as you can see, like it's just super big and flowy and oversized. Um, and this is a size small. I just think a t-shirt dress with a good old belt, you just can't beat it. Like you're not restrictive. Like, you know what I mean? Like you can move, you feel free, comfy, stylish. I honestly just think they're the best outfits, honestly. Um, but yeah, this one's really cute. I really wanted to pick up like a little red one because I don't actually own one. But yeah, normally when I put a belt on a t-shirt dress, like I'll just slightly like hoosh it out. So you kind of get like this effect where it kind of like comes out but it also just makes the dress like a little bit more um shorter but also kind of cinches you in a little bit more when you do pull it up a little bit um so you're not getting lost in the dress because sometimes the t-shirt dresses you can just be like swimming to find your way out <laughs> but that's why like the, these kind of lengths of t-shirt dress would be my kind of preference where they kind of just go above your knee or whatever also can we just talk about knees for a second i was looking in the mirror earlier like they're the ugliest thing. I honestly want to say they're the ugliest part of her body. Like look, it looks like a face. It looks like a face. I changed my hair to a bun because the ponytail is getting way too messy with the humidity. Um, so yeah, this is the next item. You will have seen this if you follow me on Instagram. And I adore this jumpsuit. I cannot explain it to you. Like this is the comfiest jumpsuit I've ever worn. It is so comfortable. Like it's so roomy and I got a size six. Like it's that stretchy. Um, you know, just say if this was like a denim material and I got a six, I would not be able to get my leg into it just to give you a bit of, um, you know, understanding of the situation. When I wore this, I actually did wear a little black bralette underneath and it was actually really cute because it just showed like a little bit of the bra like up to here and it didn't take away from the jumpsuit at all but because I'm not gifted in the booby department I don't feel very comfortable wearing low cut stuff like this because it's not flattering on me um, and not flattering on my body type and I'm just always like doing this so you know you can wear a bra with this if you are also not blessed in the booby department us booby list girls you know we're there for one another and um, but yeah I honestly think this is so flattering like even like on the bum like I feel like it is so, so, so yummy, yummy. Are you ready for today's funky item? Are you ready? <laughs> Ta -da! Oh, I love these, I can't, I actually can't. I feel like I've got a really bad camel toe, but these are so cool. Um, so they're kind of like, a, they're a tie dye kind of effect. Well, that's what I'm getting off them. So they're pink and white and they're that kind of like, you know, flowy pants. So tie up the tie, tie on the bum bum. We've actually got another flattering on the bum bum, 
which is great um, and then it just flows out and the material of these are really nice they're super stretchy and um, we're actually just going to ignore how creased this top is so this is the white top of the black one I showed you guys so the pack of two that you get and um, as I was saying they just go with absolutely anything especially if you've got a little bit of a funky moment going on down below I know I probably would get a lot of looks if I went out on these but like do I really care you know I'm dressing for myself I'm not dressing for Mary down the road you know who goes for tea with Tom on a Friday and saw Jessica strutting by and wasn't impressed with her cow looking trousers and she was bitching about me to Tom but I don't give two f's if Tom has anything to say about me do I so I'm gonna wear my tie-dye pants but no on a serious note they're so oh and they're so comfy like I love pants like this like I could proper squat in these like if I was wearing a pair of jeans now like I couldn't even lift my leg up you're quite restricted Um, lots of room for food baby you know I'm honestly so obsessed with that song at the moment if you cross her <laughs> then you cross me I think that you should know that if you cross her honestly why do I just look like I've been dragged through bushes every time I film a haul like my hair I just look like a nutter you are a nutter woman I am a nutter you're a big old nut but I don't like nuts. So I picked up this jacket and I'm just throwing it on over this to show you guys. I will not be wearing this jacket with this outfit, so don't don't worry. Um, but it's like it's a leather jacket. It's like a PU jacket. Is that is it a PV or is it PU? I feel like it's PV and I've just embarrassed myself. For sure look. <laughs> okay, so I really like the length of this jacket. It's like a really nice length. Like it just comes past your bum. I just feel like jackets like this length just aren't made enough. They're either super long, so they're either past your knee or else they're really cropped. There's just no in between. So thank you pretty little thing, you've got my back. But yeah, I really like this jacket. I've actually been meaning to pick up like a really nice leather kind of jacket for a while now. Um, but they all kind of look the same. And then I saw this one and I was like, that's really unique, you know, I love the belt on it and um, we've got like big roomy pockets it's also like a really roomy jacket so like if you wanted to like throw a jumper on under this in the winter you'd be good to go and um, i've got a few jackets that i can't wear bulky clothes under and they're just useless for half of the year do you know what i mean and um, so yeah i think it's great that's really roomy and again you'd obviously i'm um, button up these sleeves but i'm on my own so i feel like dr clues in this like i'm off to do some detective work i'm off to solve some mysteries see you later this little number this sexy little number oh my god all right so i was looking through the pretty little thing website and they had this dress in black and they had it in this color and i want to say they had it in another color and i honestly spent about 15 minutes looking at the three different colors trying to decide which one to get i could not make my mind up like the black one was so nice too and um, yeah it's so stunning it's like this like maroony deep red no it's not maroon it's like a really deep wine there we go it's like a wine red it's like a midi length um and then we've obviously got like really pretty detailing going on up around the booby area where it's like lacing the paneling bit is like see-through here and then obviously it's like covered down below um i actually wish i got this in a six i did pick this up in an eight um as you can see though there is a little bit of like extra material and um, that wouldn't have happened if I got a six but I was again looking at this dress thinking it was going to be very small fitting and not stretchy but this is like so stretchy like look how much I can move my legs <laughs> that looks so funny imagine like me going to a wedding like yeah I've got a stretch <laughs> Woo! I just thought it wasn't going to be such a stretchy material so yeah I would say for getting this you don't need to size up you could actually even size down and I'd say you'd still fit in it but it still fits me like it still looks really well like I could still go out in this and I wouldn't have anyone going oh that doesn't fit you you know what I mean Um, it's more so just about how you feel in clothes you know but yeah I feel like this would be way more flattering on my boobs if I actually had bigger boobs but you look what can you do we've got to work with what we were given and these are what I was given so I'm gonna have to work with them so I also picked up this bodysuit and it's like like this mauve purpley kind of color and I love this color I actually don't really own that many clothes in this color but it's such a pretty color and I was like why don't I I need to own clothes in this color and um, yeah it's just a slinky thong bodysuits I will only ever wear thong bodysuits I feel like bodysuits that aren't a thong are so pointless and pretty little thing I find is great for thong bodysuits like they do so many whereas I know a lot of other clothing brands 
don't do a lot of tongue bodysuits. They do a lot more of the like, you know, knicker VPL bodysuits, which I don't understand because surely tongue ones are more popular, but sure look. I actually already have this bodysuit in like a rust color, but I really wanted to pick it up in another color because I just love the fit of them. And also the square neck. I just feel like it really transforms an outfit having a bit of a square neck going on. I just find little plain colored bodysuits like this great to pair with like anything again, like, you know, like a pair of white baggy tracksuit bottoms or whatever it might be, you know, they're just so simple, especially for this time of the year, because you're not really getting the sweat patches. I find when you like kind of have your, uh, it kind of ends lower, you know, you don't tend to get the sweat patches as much as if something's like on your armpit, you know? I am such a sucker for a good try and haul and I honestly think they will forever be one of my favourite videos to film. So let me know if you'd like to see more try and hauls because I would like to see more try and hauls. I know I don't do them as often as I used to but you know I would like to see them. Would you like to see them? <laughs> let me know. Um, but yeah, I cannot wait to see it all in my next video. I love you all so very much and I'll talk to you guys super, super, super duper soon. Mwah. Bye bye friends.